Hi, this is Todd from Snap Fresh Farm. I'm coming back to you with another video log. Uh, if you want to subscribe to Snap Fresh Farm, that would be great. If you have any questions about what I'm going to show you, please feel free to ask questions on uh, my YouTube channel, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, what I wanted to do today was go over uh, the new build that I've done with the uh, system that I created. Originally, I had a system with six six uh, PVC tubes six uh, holes in each tube which was uh, 36 holes I've now expanded it to a, a lower level which I'm going to show you and on the lower level I put four tubes because I think it just fits better and it also evens out better uh, four more tubes so I've got 10 tubes six holes in each tube so 60 growing areas I've got lettuce charred I've got uh, different types of lettuce uh, growing and everything's growing really well so I want to go over that today and show you the new system give you a chance to see it and then you know you have the opportunity to build something like your, this for yourself that would be great you can uh, take anything I've done here copy it do whatever you want uh, build your own system and start growing your own lettuce really works well so uh, let's uh, I'll start showing you the the system so this is the system uh, as you can see the top level here has six tubes there's a lot growing in the tubes there's uh, chard and all kinds of lettuce uh, growing very well, very green. Uh, the nutrient is nutrient mix is working very well right now, and I've got very green lettuce and chard is just growing right up into the lights. It's growing so fast. That's the top level, and then as you can see, I now have a bottom level of four more tubes which I added on, and those tubes have more lettuce. Uh, I've taken the lettuce that was growing in the top and moved some of it down, dispersed it a little bit, and it's the same system that you saw before that I had. I've just added this shelf on as a secondary uh, system with tubes instead of the uh, bins that I had growing hydroponically before. This is a full, full uh, NFT hydroponic system. Starts out with the 27 gallon bin at the bottom here. Bin has uh, a air pumps going into it and also a water pump. The water pump pumps out of the black tube. It comes up the side goes up the side and right into a cistern here this cistern then the water goes into that cistern and then it's dispersed through each one of the tubes on the top so you've got uh, adjustments for each tube so you can adjust the water going into each tube and then the water goes down the tubes goes the nutrient goes through the plants and it comes out the back the back has tubes coming out of each one of these going down and then they go down into the bottom level of tubes with black plastic tubing. Go down these tubes, come all the way, and then they go out the, the, the end here into this PVC pipe. The PVC pipe goes right back into, that white PVC pipe goes right back into the 27 gallon bin. Now as I mix nutrients in the bin, the bin is dispersed, the water in the bin is dispersed through the pipes and the plants just keep growing and growing and growing. So this is a pretty easy system to build. It's all PVC based, black tubing, connectors. Uh, of course I've got lights. Lights you can buy in any of the big box stores like Home Depot or Lowe's. Tubing I got from aquaponics stores. And then the PVC pipes. I get 10 footers and I cut them in the store to five footers. That way it's cheaper that way. And then the shelf that I put this all on is a five shell system that I now have only uh, three shelves on it. One, two, and then the bottom shelf. Bottom shelf I'm using for growing and I grow the next level of uh, plants are growing in this box right here. Once they grow up to a certain point and they start showing roots at the bottom, then I take them and I place them into the neti cups and they'll get placed into these neti cups and they'll start growing. Here's a spinach plant that's just started growing. Uh, I just put that into the neti cup and that'll start growing. And then, like I said, I've got lots of lettuce. As you can see, the lettuce is very, very green. It's very healthy. It's excellent in salads and so is the chard. This is rainbow chard. Very strong uh, rainbow red. Uh, the roots on these are very, very heavy roots coming out. Whoops, caught here. You'll see that the roots coming out of this chard are very strong roots. 
and they're very very healthy and they're growing very well and that chard can be cut I can keep cutting that and cutting it and it'll just keep growing right in the, nu the nutrient water so that's the way things are looking and it's growing really well this is now the end of my prototyping I'm I think I'm done at this point as far as I can't add anything more to this shelf so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to start publishing uh, how to build this shelf the pieces that are needed and then you can mass produce it you can do whatever you want with it uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna copyright anything here there's nothing to be copyrighted because it's all common knowledge PV you know PVC pipe uh, NFT systems and you can build your own grow your own lettuce and there you go so thanks for visiting snap fresh farm today I hope you learned something from uh, the build that I'm doing I'll do other videos to show different parts of it uh, I'm sure you're probably wondering what these uh, these are actually pool noodles that I've placed on here and pool noodles are there to protect me so every time I go around this thing I keep hitting my head on this as you can see I don't have a lot of padding so pool noodles are on there somebody people are probably wondering what is that that's on the ends of this that's just what that is so that's just some extra added extra for you um, if you have any questions please feel free subscribe to snap fresh farm uh, add your comments love your comments add questions if you want to see how this is built I'm happy to uh, interact with you uh, put together a plan for you that you can build it yourself and then take it from there so I'm gonna just keep growing and I'm gonna keep building this uh, who knows I might end up with a second one of these uh, sometime uh, it provides for our whole family gives us enough lettuce that we can have salads pretty much every day of the week and it just keeps growing and, cir and circling with uh, added plants that I put in it and I just keep growing so have a good day and uh, take care snap fresh farm here take care bye